My name is Dr. Norman Deutsch, and I wrote a book called The Brain That Changes Itself. The discovery of neuroplasticity is the discovery that our brains can change their structure and function through mental experience alone. It signals the most important change in our understanding of the brain in 400 years, because for 400 years, we thought of the brain as though it were like a machine with parts, and that view of the machine-like brain gave rise to a neurological fatalism, because it meant people who were born with brain damage or who sustained brain damage as they developed were condemned to live with it, because machines do many glorious things, but they don't grow new parts, and they can't reorganize themselves. All of us have worries. We worry because we are intelligent creatures. The same intelligence that allows us to plan, imagine, hypothesize, also allows us to anticipate negative outcomes. There are many kinds of worriers, but among those who suffer the most are people with obsessive compulsive disorder, or OCD. Their problem, though all in the head, goes far beyond what others might experience precisely because it's in the head and therefore inescapable. It's a disorder that can often be treated by understanding neuroplasticity. This is the discovery of UCLA's Dr. Jeffrey Schwartz. People get intruding into their stream of consciousness unwanted thoughts and urges. You basically have an inner conflict where you're, you get ensnared in really bad obsessive compulsive disorder because it gets worse and worse and worse the more you relent to it. So it's a nasty, it's a nasty thing. I would say that OCD basically feels like you're trapped in your own mind. It feels like there's almost like a puppeteer really kind of making us do things and rituals that we don't want to do but we have to. You're dealing with such a high level of anxiety and high level of stress that you, you physically are sick. And this is happening day after day, hour after hour. Um, it wasn't long before I fell into a depression. Contamination fears, I constantly was washing my hands. It even got to the point where I would lie so